Um, 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 excuse me. There's a lot going on in February. Let's get into it. So February 1st, we had a new moon in Aquarius. Shout out to all my fellow Aquarius. Ah, I see you. February 2nd is a very significant day because it's a day of angel numbers 2 to 2022. 20, so you see, you get it. So two is a number that means balance. It means abundance. It means wisdom. It means so many different positive things in various spiritual communities. So February 2nd, 2022 is a day filled of goodness. Then on February 3rd, Mercury goes direct. So communication improves. Then on February 14th, Mercury moves into Aquarius. Shout out to all my Aquarius again. Then on February 16th, we have a full moon in Leo. And I'll do another video when we get closer to the full moon. But right now, between the new moon and the full moon, what should we be doing spiritually? With having a new moon in Aquarius on the first, a day of abundance and prosperity on the second, Mercury going direct on the third, Mercury moving into Aquarius on the 14th, and a full moon on the 16th, what should we be doing? Two of the biggest traits of Aquarius are detachment and creativity. This is the perfect time to emotionally detach from societal expectations and opinions and tap into yourself. We are still at the top of a new year, so this is the perfect time to answer the question, who am I and what do I truly desire? Detach from the world and tap into self. And don't be afraid to be creative. Don't be afraid to dream big. Don't be afraid to be wild in thought. Then be innovative about how you choose to manifest it. This is a time of freedom. Feel free, let go. Release expectations and just be your wild, crazy, free, authentic self. This is your time. You deserve it. Much love.